Hi guys, I'm Randy Sama. Welcome to Overdrive. And right now we are at Eichma 2024 at Roll and Field stall where we can see these uh, two prototypes or uh, two concepts, maybe we can call them concepts, which is uh, the Flying Free, the latest brand or latest vertical, uh, which is um, announced uh, by Roll and Field. This is their uh, electric range and they have announced C6 and S6. Uh, where uh, C6 is uh, going to be launched in 2026. So uh, right now what we are looking at is not a production ready bike because uh, this we can call uh, a concept or prototype but you can understand the kind of uh, design theme or philosophy Royal Enfield uh, is uh, thinking of uh, following and I'm 6 feet and look at this bike if you can uh, you know compare it uh, with my height you can understand this is not a regular Royal Enfield uh, bikes you generally see this is smaller this is thinner, this is uh, very uh, sharp or, uh, you know, from front, it is looking very narrow. And some of the elements uh, will remind you of uh, the typical Royal Enfield, for example, the headlamps, but other elements, for example, this uh, girdle uh, front fork, this is something which they have uh, adapted from their 1940 flying flea. And this is kind of tribute to that uh, motorcycle. And uh, this, uh, we don't know what kind of battery pack uh, this will have. And we also don't know the kind of range. But Royal Enfield is pitching this as a, you know, city plus bike, which uh, would have a range where you can use it uh, in urban setting. But uh, at the same time, if you want to take it for a longer ride, you can take it. So we don't know about the range. We don't know about the battery size. We don't know about the battery chemistry yet. But uh, this is more or less the kind of shape we are going to see. There's so many elements we were uh, you know, uh, curious about. For example, uh, the tire, the profile the tire, this is 1990-19 uh, profile tire. Uh, uh, and looking at your comments, you find these tires to be uh, maybe uh, too thin. But uh, what Paul and Peel is saying that uh, they are thinking of uh, you know, uh, looking at different uh, versions they will make some changes but at the same time this is the kind of bike uh, we have in front of us so let's take a closer look at uh, this motorcycle other than this uh, front fork which is uh, again uh, very interesting fu retro futuristic kind of design this has a uh, you know, single uh, uh, disc at front and uh, then look at this shape which feels like uh, a fuel tank which obviously uh, is not because uh, uh, this is an electric bike and the battery cover which has very interesting looking uh, fin design, uh, which also reminds you of those old school uh, engines. And we just have one foot peg over here, no uh, brake lever. And the, these panels, uh, most of them uh, are just for uh, display purpose. This is not a, a production ready bike. We are not uh, going to ride it uh, anytime soon because, as you know, the launch is uh, expected in 2026. But what we can see is that uh, this bike is, hardly has any chrome on it which we generally see on Royal Enfield or we associate Royal Enfield with. Uh, this has lots of aluminium and this is something which uh, Royal Enfield is focusing on. So as I said, this is uh, not a production ready bike. This is a prototype or a concept. Uh, the launch is in 2026. We don't know the uh, expected pricing, but uh, you know, expect it to be a bit more premium than the typical electric vehicles uh, we or electric two-wheelers we see. And uh, this is going to be a new uh, kind of uh, market, new kind of segment for Royal Enfield or any motorcycle manufacturer uh, in that sense because uh, if we look at electric bike market, we don't have so many lifestyle products. Uh, most of the two-wheelers which are uh, battery powered, they are used as, uh, you know, uh, for uh, general commuting purpose and utility purpose. So this is a product which uh, Royal Enfield hopes to, uh, you know, cater to or appeal to those kind of uh, riders who are not uh, too much into the thump of Royal Enfield. And that is something which will, uh, you know, the riders of our generation might miss. But uh, let's see how this uh, turns out, what kind of uh, battery size, battery packs, battery chemistry, or uh, the shapes and size, the tire uh, size, what are the final figures. But this is what we saw at ICMA 2024. So how do you like this bike? And uh, what kind of price band you think uh, it will uh, be launched in? And... Would you be interested in, you know, buying a lifestyle bike like this, which is an electric? Do let us know in the comment section. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.